Hey guys, this is Didi Witcher one here on Jimmy Master Mechanics. I'd like to start out this video apologizing for not making many reviews lately, but tomorrow I'm going to record a lot of them, so you guys will have endless entertainment, of course, for several days to come. So yeah, what I have to review for you today is the, the Jimmy animated Dancing and Freaky Geek Frankenstein prototype. So yes, I have the prototype one. You're probably thinking, wait, I thought I saw the prototype one in the 2000 subscriber video. And I also thought I saw another one in the Jimmy fans recent review. Well, believe it or not, there are three known to exist at this point, including this one. So the one at Bailey's place is more like a sample where the only difference is the eye color and the pitch. Whereas this one has some more distinct differences, which I'll get into. I know I've gotten several complaints about my reviews being too lengthy with the describing of the items, so I will try and not make it too lengthy for your pleasure. So we'll just go straight into the details. So the eye color is different than the other one. So the, the produced ones light up a whitish color, like they look like this, but on the inside they light up white. The, the like sample one lights up like a purplish whitish color and these basically light up like a purplish orangish color which I really like and then also apparently the motion sensor is like green instead of black I'm thinking the shoes may be a different tint but I could of course be wrong maybe the chain color as well and and with this one, unlike the other one, you can actually see some more like hand-painted details, like the teeth are rather shiny, as you can see from the reflection of the flash on here. And you can definitely tell that the, the mouth is like sort of hand-painted on some of the details. Although with some of these older items, you can act, they actually look like they're like hand-painted when they're not, it seems. Here's the side. Some more detail. I'll get to the tag in a minute. Here's the back. It does take the 6 volt, but I have not used a 6 volt on it. And here's the other side. I guess we'll go ahead and show the back bottom of it. So there it is, a normal battery cover. And there is the off demo and on. And I'm not sure what the demo mode does actually. I'm assuming it's the same or it could be shorter or whatever. Um, yeah, and then, because I'm sorry, but I, this is, believe it or not, the two Frankensteins are the only ones I own, funny enough, and they're not even like the produced models. But yeah, so here's the tag, I'm number 20736, and the rest of it is in Chinese. If you want to translate that, that would be pretty cool, but I'm not going to do that. And then this is the little pass thing, it says 2004 on there. Of course, this was not signed off because they didn't make it with the low pitch and the eye color but this is stamped 2004 I think that's February something 2004 didn't quite stamp on all the way but yeah so enough describing now I'll play it I'll do it once like this once with the flash off and I'll do it one more time in the dark so I hope you guys enjoy and this was restored by this guy named CJ who originally got this and then I did a trade with him for it or something he really wanted. So yeah, thanks to him for restoring it, but now I'll demonstrate it for you. So you probably couldn't see the eyes that well, but now you'll see them better.
Now we'll turn the light off so you can really see the eyes, which I think are honestly a little bit cooler. Oh, wow, it's so dark in here. Okay, let me find the button. I can't even really see in here, guys, so this is the real experience. <laughs> You know, it actually looks very cool in the dark because since it's like hand painted and stuff, you get to like see the face with all the details lighting up that like orangish purplish mix of a color in the dark. And when it's flashing and the head's tilting, you see it for a second then you don't, then you see it again in a different position. So this is a really cool prototype. I'm really glad I got it. Thanks again to CJ for the deal he made. And yeah, so. Thank you guys for watching, and if you want to see more prototype videos, because there is plenty of subject matter to cover there, I will say that, be sure to comment down below and let me know. But thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.